Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a whole nother episode of Metro Sim Hustle, where we will continue, I guess, to get our hustle on and become, I I don't know, what, what the hell am I supposed to be? Like the greatest of all time? <laughs> like the greatest train operator of all time? I don't know, dude. Uh, but yeah, this game is a little intense, right? Uh, we've already know, we already do know. How much money do we even have? Can I actually see that map unavailable? That that that's not what I want. I want an inventory actually. Uh, we have sixty nine. <laughs> Damn right, we got sixty nine dollars in this freaking world. I feel like we're in like a cyberpunk slash sexy night city. That's cyberpunk, right? Night city. I haven't played that game since launch, right? I know it got a bad rap. I know, like, I get Cyberpunk got a bad rap. I enjoyed my playthrough. I did. And I, I haven't played it since launch, so there's been a ton of updates and hotfixes, mainly updates, since uh, the game's release. And I'm actually sitting here, like, thinking, I was like, oh, you know what? I, I think I'm going to go back to that game sometime soon and, and just enjoy it, really, and maybe start a whole new file and all that. So, yeah, and I'm not saying I'm going to put that on YouTube. I'm just saying in my own leisure time, I, I'll do that. So there we go. All right. So we have an order received. I mean, this is like the easiest two dollars, right? We can just go ahead and do this on our way to work, possibly. I don't know. Our hydration and our uh, nutrition. Oh, there we go. Is at a is at a good spot, right? We could definitely go into. Um, yo, what the hell are they doing over there? <laughs> Dude, the, my guy is doing the step. Maybe possible Carlton in a polo shirt. What the hell are you doing? Like this guy, I get it. This guy, I don't get it. <laughs> Good for you. Good for you. Um, oh, what do we got going on here? We got something spicy going on over here. What are you guys doing? Don't touch her. Hello? Can I talk to you? No, I cannot talk to you. Can I talk to you? I cannot talk to you. Why do you... Why? Never mind. <laughs> I'm not even going to get into that. Uh, yeah, so hydration and uh, nutrition is something we need to worry about today. I am going to go to the Jacob's Variety Shop here. Dude, this guy is always bumping it. Uh, I'm going to go into the shop here. I'm going to buy a little bit of food, a little bit of snacks, a little bit of this. And then we're going to run on over across the street and uh, actually do our job, which is be a metro train operator, I guess. Or whatever that's worth. Uh, yes, I would like to buy... Ooh, you got new stuff today, right? Oh, you got new... Oh, okay, so this is one thing I really like about this game. The stock replenishes every single day. One thing I don't like about this game. $12 for a grape soda. I call BS. God damn it. All right, so... We'll, we'll buy a $12 soda. <laughs> cannabis seeds? What? Cannabis seeds are this primary essential ingredients in cannabis production. Yo. Oh my god. Okay, dye. Dye is secondary essential ingredient in MDMA production. I, is that like uh, acid, maybe? Acid? Don't ask how I know this stuff. This looks like sushi. Yeah, sushi. So let's go ahead and get... No, not $60 food. $200 cannabis seeds? Cocaine for $40? Get me the hell out of here. Spring rolls for $60? Yeah, what? What? No. <laughs> I guess no nutrition today. This game is freaking crazy, dude. Let me tell you what. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and enjoying some more Metro Sim. It's really a pleasure and honor being with you here today. As every day, it's a pleasure and honor being with you here today. Why do I say it's a pleasure and honor being with you here today? Because the fact that I can have the ability to, to play some games, enjoy some banter back and forth, and have people watch my, uh, watch my content is always a pleasure. And it's always an honor doing it for you. Um, so let's, let's not turn on our flashlight and let's pull up our inventory. Let's just crack open a can of soda blueberry okay i thought it was grape soda but i guess it's blueberry did that give us a lot of hydration no it did not it just made us more disgusting all right let's go to our high terrorism threat see i i i don't get it <laughs> I, I don't get it skill points 200 and uh and uh 54 now hang on a sec controls is there like a okay flashlight inventory phone maybe phone maybe it's the phone okay phone i don't know why phone is p but phone is p do we have something like that involves skills or something? Painter, thruster, settings, arcade, camera. Slots, drift. We actually haven't pulled out our camera. Free movement.
Hey, don't ask. <laughs> don't ask what I just did, but I did it anyways. She she has no idea. Yeah, let's just go do our job. I don't know what the skill points is. I don't know how to use that. So I guess maybe we'll figure that out going forward. I'm not, I'm not really sure. I honestly don't. Um, but yeah, you know, we need money. That, that's just how it is. Now, again, this thing is a little bit funky uh, as far as like how to move and stuff. It's like M is accelerator, which is God help me, right? Uh, so ready to depart. So can we depart? Okay, so let's change... There we go. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Parking brake. Uh, parking brake off, please. No, that's not the parking brake. Oh, shit. What's the parking brake? Okay. Do not open the doors. Do not suppress the fire. Do not cut the alarm. Do not ring the bell. Do not. There's a parking brake. Okay. All right. I think we're ready. Let's go forward. All right. Sounds good. Whew. Metro Sim Hustle. Here we go. 30 miles an hour. You are on the Civic Line. Why, yes. Okay, so like before, I'm going to try to do this job way more efficient than last time. Because last time, I didn't do it very efficiently, as you could probably guess. Now, I do have my finger on the horn and on the accelerator and on the brakes. Well, I don't, you know, I'm not using the brakes quite yet, but I will hit the brakes when I need to hit the brakes. What's the mileage? 30 miles an hour. All right. I can't see a damn thing. All right, so here we go. Here comes first stop. 14 seconds left to make it to the first stop. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Security threat. Okay, so there is a security threat, so we are going to need to get on the on the phone, I guess. Okay, stop. Okay, security. Call security. Okay, okay open the doors. Okay, passengers are in. I forgot what button was the doors, so I, I'm, I'm using the actual door here. Okay, everyone's here. All right. Oh, my God. All right. Go. <laughs> I hit the horn instead of the accelerator, dude. <laughs> that was so good. All right. So there's a worker up here, I believe. All right. So, so I mean, so far, so good. I mean, that was, that was pretty good. I closed the doors. All right. I closed the doors. Ring the bell. Yeah. Ring the bell. 40 miles an hour is our speed limit here. Okay. The stop is right up here. We have 15 seconds. Okay, 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 okay. All right, get the hell out. Oh, speed train, baby. How you like me now? Okay, passengers coming in. Passengers coming in. A lot of passengers. Okay, go. <laughs> okay, so I get it. I'm starting to figure it out now. You got to go fast. You got to go fast. I don't know how metro trains actually work in real life, but... You gotta go fast. What is this? 50 miles an hour? Oh my god. Everybody hold on back there. I, I, it's not gonna be a bumpy ride, but it's gonna be a fast ass ride here. Honk it. Good job. Dude, you got a weird hand. There we go. Alright, 50 miles an hour. We're gonna be blazing speed here. Oh shit, there's the station. Oh shit, here we go again. Okay, slow down, 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 slow down. Emergency brake! Ah! Open up, open up. Get out. Oh, right on time. All right, I don't even know what the emergency brake is. Let's be honest here. But, okay, go. Close the doors. Where's the emergency brake at? Airspeed, headlights, cab light, parking brake. That's the emergency brake. Oh, wait, right there, emergency brake. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so the big red button, don't piss, don't piss the big, no, don't push the big red button, right? You've seen it in every movie of all time. Don't push the big red button. That's what happens, with the, I mean, emergency brake, that's what we'll hit. Oh, God, we're over the speed limit. Let's see what happens if we're over the speed limit. Hopefully, this is like a 40 mile an hour zone. Okay, that is a 40 mile an hour zone. Great. Okay, we are now okay. Keep it coming, baby. Keep it coming. A little bit more. Okay, here's our stop. Coming in hot, coming in hot. This might be the best thing we've ever do. Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. If you need to hit the brake, you can hit the brake. Okay, I think you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Oh, I hit the wrong one. Stop zone. Everybody out. Excuse me, everybody out. Uh, excuse me, everybody out. Am I not in the zone? 
Okay, everybody out? No. No, everybody out. Okay, open. Open door. Close doors? Open doors. I don't know what the hell just happened there. Okay. Doors are open. We have more people. 100 people. I kept hitting the horn. Okay, go. No, wrong way. That way. I went backwards. <laughs> I think I was driving the train with my doors open that last time. Let's just make sure the doors are closed. I gotta read that. Doors closed. That would have been freaking scary. That was hauling ass, too. Alright, so this is a very short stop, I think. 30 miles an hour. Right, yep. 30 miles an hour. I'm not gonna go over 30 miles an hour. There's our stop. Okay. Okay, hold on. 10 seconds. Break, 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 break. Stop zone. Stop. 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 Okay. Open up. Go. 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 Okay. They are being unloaded. Total time. Four minutes and 29 seconds. Did I complete it? I think I completed. I think we're all good. So this is everybody. Close the doors and head on. Continue to continue to exit the route. All right. So I feel like we did a really good job that time. I do. I feel like we did a really good job. And if you say otherwise, how dare you? I, I did a good job. I felt good. I felt good about that. I really did feel good about that. Uh, let's just continue to the end track here, then we'll get out, and then we'll continue our life. I should probably be careful. If I need to hit the emergency brake, I will. Watch out, worker. I don't know. I don't know. Where do I stop? Just keep going, I guess. Okay, this is where I stop. Slow, slow, slow. Slow. Okay, there's, there you go. Just emergency break it. There we go. All right, line completion bonus. You get $8, you get a potato chips, and you get a hot dog. That was an annoying sound. Did you hear that? So line completion bonus. You get $8, potato chips, and a hot dog. Well, that was nice of them. How much money did we actually get? Looks like we only got $160. Why do I feel like that is nothing? Well, it probably feels like nothing. Skill points earned though, 320, only 1,900 skill points remaining for upgrade to B license. Okay, so the skill points go into the license um, and then we can drive a faster, more powerful, maybe more capacity, higher train, I, I, I guess, I don't know. But there we go, day two of our, uh, of our train and it seemed to go well. Now we do have some food we can have, so let's have a hot dog since we got some of that, some potato chips. There we go, very nice, all right, cool. I like it. She's hot and bothered. So am I. <laughs> so am I. So we don't have a lot of money. It's not like we can go off and just like blow $226. I mean, they're selling hot dogs over there for like 60 bucks. It ain't happening, right? Now, there is our alternatives, right? Prostitution might be an alternative. Uh, no, there is an alternative being that we could sell drugs, make drugs, I guess. But the cops here are just outrageously everywhere. Like They're, they're everywhere, dude. We're gonna break into one of these places though. Let's break into this place. Make sure no cop is looking. Okay, let's go. I forgot how to do this. How do you do this again? Oh, I never mind. This is a place I've already entered before. Now I wonder if stuff resets, like the loot resets. Ooh, it does. Nice, okay. Ooh. Nice. Three dollars. I mean, cool, I guess. So any place I guess you lockpick opened, right? Um, after the next day the loot response so that's good to know so we, we could actually pop open some of that hydration for us like a nice strong beer gave us zip as far as uh hydration but i guess our sanity will go up for that watermelon soda watermelon sugar hi oh my god are we drunk it's blurry as hell now oh that's not good <laughs> that is not good work a side hustle by trading items with npcs you make a better re oh crap dude we are drunk I don't like the blurriness. I'll, I'll be honest. Like, I know I'm drunk. Give me a different look here. Yo, we got a lottery ticket. Take it. This, this is this is our yeah. This is our food. Like, this is where we get food now. <laughs> we go into these places that we broke into, and we this is where we get food. Oh yo yo, blurry, blurry, blurry. It's like mess with my actual eyes in real life. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> we'll exit. Route panel. Use the route panel to alternate between scheduled stops. The next stop in sequence is displayed on the schedule. Interesting. 
Now, there is another spot over here. I don't think we've lockpicked this one. Nope. Full concentration. You fuck! I apologize for the language there. <laughs> yep. Ah! All right. I have no more lockpicks. God, son of a... Uh. All right. Dude, the hell is going on with this van? Okay, I don't need a tutorial on furniture, but what's going on with this van? This looks like a stakeout. Trash can? <laughs> what is that? A bottle of whiskey, dude. Can we talk to this gentleman? Hello, how are you? Oh, you're the one dancing in Central Park, weren't you? Okay, arena? Coming in way too hot, sweetheart. Let's cross the street. Oh, look at this. There's like a nice little uh, bay front here, kind of. That's kind of cool. That's nice. Don't look at me. Now, this is the woman I think we took a picture of. Yep, that is. <laughs> Urban estate. Now, we did get the lottery, right? Lottery ticket. Let's actually use this. See if we get any money. Close, but no cigar, unfortunately. Like, what's in there? Can I go in there? I can't go in there. What is that? It's a present? Present contained a lottery ticket? Dude, there's Easter eggs around this in this game? That's incredible. Let's use it again. Damn it. Our luck is just terrible. But that's really cool. So keep your eye out for presents, I guess. That's neat. I love that how the game does that. Keeps you on your toes. Even though I just do not have... Um, I don't have any lockpicks to kind of break into any of these buildings. But I am kind of like interested in the uh, casino over here. Should I test my luck? The pit stop? Can I use this? Oh, I guess I can. Let's go into here. Yeah. Ooh, trash. Ooh, what is that? Cooked entree? I mean, is it good for us? Yo, that gave us incredible stats for nutrition. Yeah, let's go into the casino. We're going to go into the casino. And we're going to test our luck, baby. We're going to see if we can get rich quick, right? Okay, there's horse betting. There's some slots. Looks like some tables. Like, honestly, the first machine. Bet one. Uh, bet one. I don't even know how much one bet was. <laughs> uh, bet two. Okay, so hang on a sec. Let's see how much money. $234. So how much is one bet? One dollar. Okay, so one bet is one dollar. I'm fine with that. Yo, what is that? Look at that bad boy. I'm in. Lucky spin. 200 or 2,500 points required to spin. Points? What are you talking about points, my man? Okay, bet three. Oh, we got three dollars. We probably spent ten dollars for that, though. What do you got going on here? Is this blackjack? All right, some blackjack. A hundred dollars, fifty dollars, or five dollars? Let's do no, that's not do fifty. Let's do five. This is Natasha Bentley. Okay, I would like to increase my bet to 20, please. Let's deal. Yo, 20? I'm standing. I just won $20. Cause did we push? I think we might have pushed. Okay, let's do it again. 17. Stand. I lost $20. Okay, deal again. Nine. Hit me. 11. Hit me. 20. Stand. I win $20. Okay. 8. Hit me. 18. Stand. I lose $20. <laughs> uh, Alright. 20. Stand. Push. Damn it. 12. Hit me. Stand. It's a push. Good. Deal. 20. Stand. I lost $20. Hit me. Stand. Lost $20. Uh, stand. 
I win $20. All right, so how did we do? We lost like $20. Let's talk to Natasha. Natasha Bentley. Hi, I hope you're here to tell me something important. You look like you're going to stab me. Hey, you look pretty fancy. Maybe I should have avoided you. It's very loud in this casino. Thanks. I'm on a modeling contract this week. It's been my most stressful week in a long time. I bet you could teach me a lot about fashion. I'm basically just a big slob. So, what happened to you? Did someone piss you off or piss in your coffee? You need some fun. Let's go play dress up at my place. I'll book you a fashion consolation, but I should let you know, they're quite expensive. Being a sales associate at a high-end retailer must be challenging in the city full of poor losers. Do you have kids? Because you would be the worst mom ever. What is up with the insults? It must be fan fascinating for a moron like you, dude. We have clientele from all over the metropolitan area visit my store. I'm looking for work and I bet you make a lot of money selling that overpriced crap at your store. You're the most annoying person I've ever met in my life. We need more tough people like you in this city, Natasha. People that know how to speak their mind. Damn it! But the way that you've dressed, you'll be more suited to looting trash cans for leftover food. She's not wrong. So it looks like we need some nice clothes in order to, to kind of get these people on our side. Um, can we, like, buy anything from her? Oh, my God. We can. We can buy a bed from her? Can we sell anything to her? Like, would she, like, go down, like, for some nice cigarettes for 15 bucks? Really? Do I look like that type of person that's going to buy something that's already been half used? Fair enough. I guess I'll buy that from you. Alright, so regular cigarettes she took. What about, like, a bottle of whiskey? Are you interested in a bottle of whiskey? Really? Okay. She's not interested. Alright, well, at least we got $15 from her. That's cool. Who's this? Marvin Moss. Hell of a name, brother. Hell of a name. Let's go to the horse betting. Let's see how the horse betting is all doing over here. All right, this is good stuff. Now, horse betting has always been embedded for centuries, right? Or years, I would say centuries. Horse betting was uh, a big part of one of my favorite games growing up, and that was um, that was Harvest Moon. Full auto. I got 20 on full auto because he's 69 and he's blue. So send them off. Next race in five seconds. Full auto. It's all on you, buddy. Oh my god. How many laps? Three laps? Three laps? Full auto coming through. Full auto, full auto takes the lead. He takes the lead. He's going around the bend. He's on the final lap. He's being chased by Mr. Red. Who's Mr. Red? That is going to be Lola. Lola in full auto. Full auto. Yes. 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 $30 in our pockets. Walk away happy. Hello, Leon Dusk. Elon Musk. <laughs> what inspires you? I see someone like you get robbed out here most nights. You're traveling to space. Great. I was looking to ticket. This is Elon Musk, isn't it? Another entrepreneur get a real job? Great life without the possibility of intergalactic space travel would be extremely boring. Oh, you think you can go to space? You could do it. Can you draw me a few shares of your company? I'll pay you next week. I'm a thrill seeker like you, Leon. Join me at the casino tomorrow night. Let's know. Drop me a few shares, homeboy. Hmm. Let me think about it. Uh, no. Maybe being launched into space will shake thing, things, these hangos, hango, hangovers over? Right. I bet you're a climate change activist, too. Get out of my way. What the hell are you doing out here? Shouldn't you be trolling, all of, oh, toiling over a guidance system of, or some crap? Um, what kind of overachieving hot shot prick do you think you are? Maybe I can help out in your research lab. Like, I can be the guy that orders pizzas or something. Pizza party sounds good. Stop by my lab sometime. Uh, I hope a mountain of riches of unending intergalactic sex reward your ambitious piece. <laughs> he loves it. Make sure to stop by again. We'll be among the stars soon. You know what? Can I actually talk to you? Can I buy anything from you? I can. How much are you selling that, dude? Lottery ticket for five bucks? I'll buy it. I'll buy all your lottery tickets and I'll buy your lock picks. I will also sell you a bottle of whiskey. I'm not really interested in that. How dare you? 
I will sell you some frozen entrees. I will sell you extra strength cigarettes. All right, get the hell out of my face, Elon. All right, let's walk out of here. Wow. That was a very, very loud place. That casino was deathly loud. All right, so let's actually take a look at what we have now. So we have lottery tickets. Let's go ahead and see if we get lucky. F off. All right. One more. Sex machine, apparently. <laughs> Damn it, dude. We're going to win one of those one day. Whenever that may be. Now, our hydration is low. I'm not going to be, like, swigging a bottle of liquor right now because I don't want to get all loopy. Now, we do have some more lockpicks that we can kind of go through here. I do want to, like, buy a drink, though. Give me, like, a lime. Thank you. Oh, do I have to grab it? Oh, I do. Okay, so there we go. We got our lime. Let's go ahead and drink some of that up. Gives us a little bit of hydration, not a lot. But a regular cola. Give me a regular cola. How's that do? That does well? It does better. Did you just push me, Daniel? How dare you, Daniel? Oh, Posh. That's where that lady works at. Posh is where that lady works at. I'm actually interested a little bit. Let's go into the and see their clothes real quick. I think we went into this in the last episode. Uh, but she said something about like how she doesn't like us because of our clothes. So I'm kind of interested to see here. Let's see what happens. Is this her, right? Natasha! Natasha! I thought you were in the casino, my lady. Have something to say to me? Uh, yeah, I'd like to buy some stuff, maybe, possibly. You're not. Can I sell you a frozen entree? If that's not diamond studded, then I'm not interested. Can I sell you some extra strength cigarettes? Okay. Um, yeah, so... How do I buy clothes? She didn't have any clothes to offer. Look, Natasha. Oh, right here. Okay, shoes. How much do these cost? Okay, $30. Not too bad. How much do these cost? $20? Cargo pants? Dress pants? $25. These are actually reasonably priced. <laughs> these are very reasonably priced. I'm going to buy those. And then for a shirt, let's buy not a puffer jacket. Good God. Yeah, a nice black shirt with black uh, pants. You already know how I roll. Uh, shoes. Canvas shoes, leather boots. No, leather shoes. I actually used to wear leather shoes like this all the time. There we go. All right, so now we have some good clothing options here. So let's see here. Can we actually put these on? Let's equip that. Equip that. And equip that. Now we should be looking kind of stylish for her. Can we sell her our old clothing? Um, Not for me. If it's not okay, okay, she just, she's not interested now. Can we actually talk to her now? So chat um, You look like you're going to stab me. Hey, you look pretty fancy. We'll do that We'll build her relationship up and maybe this will take us somewhere, right? Uh, I bet you can teach me a lot about fashion um, to, 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 to piss on your coffee Yeah fashion. I'll book you a fashion consultant, but it's you know, it's yeah, we already know it's gonna be expensive So this is where it was at being a sales associate at high retailer must be a challenge all right, so we did do that. Now her relationship's at a high. Wait, I have a request. You can help me, right? Oh, baby, here we go. Yes, of course I can help you. Good. I have an in intricate problem. You've probably seen the latest fashion magazine on me, right? It just came off the press today, and the magazine is all over the city, but I want it eradicated immediately. Find every copy of that effing magazine and destroy them all. Come back here when you're done, and I'll give you something in return. Now, don't waste my time. All right, nice. We got a quest. Holy crap, Natasha gave us a quest. So she wants all of her magazines gone. Well, magazines, pictures of her gone. Now, where would these magazines be, I wonder? Is that it? <laughs> nope. Yeah, where where would you even try to find these magazines? Now, the good thing here is that we have it as a task, right? So we don't need to, like, like go, like, anal on it, right? We don't need to, like find or oh, go after it all the time right we have it in our back pocket in case we come across it right so let's go into the front cafe here because the front cafe is um sounding kind of interesting we need our hydration and nutrition up a little bit hello um yeah this is kind of cool front cafe oh present there's a present what's in it contain the lock pick damn it that's all right why hello how are you 
This is Anna. Have you tried our specialty hot beverages yet? Give me a regular decaf, non-fat cream cappuccino with double espresso. Jesus Christ, I don't even know how to order from, from people like this. Uh, do you serve coffee or just overpriced liquid with trash? That's insulting. Tall order. I didn't catch all that. I'm new here. Say again. Uh, it, is it just me or does it reek of cannabis in here? I got a whiff of cannabis when I walked in through the front door. Do you know where I can get a hold of some? I saw you smoking weed outside the arcade last night. You must know where I can score some pot. Damn it! I'm not sure why it would smell like weed in here. Okay, so probably confronting her would, would probably be a better idea there. Can we buy anything from her? Now there's plushies. What the hell is this? LSD. Okay, so that there they, there is the capabilities of making acid. So she's she's more interested in acid. Do you want to buy my shoes? No. Do you want to buy my entree? I wish I could afford that. Do you want to buy my cigarettes? Well, I might if I if they weren't half used. Okay, understand. So let's take a look here. Ooh, this is it. Magazine. Magazine acquired. Awesome. So I guess they might be all in the little shops and everything. So can you have an iced tea, please? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would like a green iced tea for $3. And then, hell, give me like a donut, dude. Oh, that looks freaking good. <laughs> that looks delicious. All right, so a, a donut and a, and a beverage. And yeah, decent on the hydration. Yeah, decent on the nutrition. You could probably have a couple more. Let's have a red tea. Buy two of those. And then buy a pink donut. And a croissant. There we go. All right. That should be fine on our nutrition and all that. So use the croissant. Wow, that actually put us up all the way. Use the iced tea. Use the iced tea. There we go. All right. So hygiene bladder. Okay, look. We need to take a piss. Thank you so much. What the heck? This is weird. I, hair dry, hair dryer. Ah! Okay, we used the toilet just now. Let's use the sink. I, I guess we don't need to use the sink. I don't know, dude. We'll just walk out of here. Yeah, so that's very good. So very good to know that magazines are placed ev a little bit of everywhere, I guess. We did get one magazine. There probably is a magazine in the casino. Am I worried about it? Nah, not really. Not, not really. I'm not diving out of the freaking way to, to, to help what's-her-face. The fact that we have the side quest, I'm okay with, right? I'm all right with that. Now, there's something spicy going on over here. Let's go check this out. Is this the bank? What is this? No, this is a residence. Oh, wow. This is fancy stuff. Yo, what are you doing? Oh, look at this guy. How cool is this? Do your workout, man. What is this? Water fountain? Can I drink? Maybe not. Trash? Nothing in the trash can. Fair enough. What is this? Hello? This is the Far East Sushi. Nice. Okay, cool. Far East Sushi. Hello? How are you? Natasha? Dude, that's Natasha. Natasha. I'm, I'm actively trying to get your magazines. I, I know you have a problem. I'm trying to get that for you, sweetheart. Okay, so there's five magazines right here. You can see how many magazines do you need. You need five. So we need four more. So that's good to know. At least we can click on that and see uh, how much we need and, and, and whatnot. So that's good. Now, what is that place? Oh, that's the Metro. That's our that's our, our job. <laughs> now, I wonder if there's a magazine in Jacob's variety. Now, there could have been a magazine in the sushi place. I know. You best believe it. There it is. So... There's two magazines done. I think I might go back to the um, sushi place. Yeah, I'm going to go back to the sushi place. First, we've never been there, so there might be a present for us. And uh, second, uh, chances of having a magazine in there is probably high at this point, for sure. So let me just run over here. Hello, how are you? Far East, a Far East sushi. Now, I would love to see what this is all about. How cool is this going to be? Oh, dude, look at this. Scarlet Price, eh? Do you guys have a magazine here by any chance? You'll have a present that has a cookie in it. But you do not have any magazine, unless the magazine's in the bathroom here. It is not. But thank you so much. I will get to you guys later down the road, probably, when I have time. I don't have the time right now. I'm sorry. So let's continue this way. It's three, it's almost four in the morning. Good God. This place never sleeps. This city is going all the time. 
Look at that guy. He goes all the time, too. All right, so let's go this way. Uh, there is, like, a little bit of, like, a red cross over there. Possibly, like, medical of some sort, maybe. I don't know. Let's actually check this trash can. That was weird. Okay. Trash can. Trash can. Send it. Excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Check this trash can. No, the clinic. Okay, so this is the clinic. Specializing in all cosmetic and medical procedures. Can you get some, uh, you know, some pros you know, plastic, I don't know, plastic surgery, maybe? Uh, do you have, well, actually, what do you have to sell, first of all? Surgical. Gender reassignment, lung transplant, gastric bypass, my lord, medicine, steroids, really? You can, I wonder if you could sell some steroids to somebody. Maybe that guy that's doing the weight training, be like, hey, dude, I got some steroids for you. Are you interested? No? Then get out of here. All right, so there we go. There's the clinic. Clinic's all said and done. Now, where else? Oh, dude, Teddy's Arcade. Teddy's Arcade would be probably a spot for a magazine, maybe. Let's go there. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Enter. No, watch. Teddy's not going to be anything, dude. He's not going to be like, it's not going to be anything at all. He's going to be like, nope, no magazine for you. Oh, there it is. Okay, so there's three of five. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Teddy. Funny name, but thank you, Theodore. All right, so it is getting a little bit late. Our energy is getting a little bit down for the most part. Um, now we got to kind of like find our way back to the derelict building. I believe it's this way. Yeah, it is this way. So we'll start heading back to the derelict building. Um, hygiene is a big issue coming up very soon. So that's something that we're going to need to get going on. This guy looks um, Gene Claude. He looks like a someone that needs drugs or maybe at my ass for drugs or something. I don't know, dude. Oh, trash can. Nothing in the trash can. I get excited. Ah, trash can. Yes. All right, so let's go over here and check this trash can before we go down to our humble of O. What does that even mean? I don't even know. Now, the arena is something also that's kind of something I'm interested in. And that club over there, we haven't been in that club either. That's actually like... That's actually like a strip club, dude. Which, yeah. <laughs> That's something we haven't done. So let's go downstairs. Let's take a shower. Get our music bumping. Love this little shanty here. Shut that. Bathroom. Uh, shower. Yeah, take a shower. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. We're all showered up. We're looking fantastic, hopefully. And sleep and save the game. But that's going to do it in today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please make sure to hit that like. And I will see you in the next Metro Sim Hustle where we continue to become... I don't even know what we're trying to become. But we're, guess we're trying to become something awesome. Somebody awesome. And maybe we're just trying to become an asshole. I don't know. But till next time, I'll see you in the next video. Do take care. This is for all of you, not just a song to listen to, something to give you hope to hang on to. I'll be your pocket full of